is, is Felix is he. And once again, I'm Tony Anson here with Crew Tyrone. We're here at Fury 3 as Felix Ishkaev comes up, who is 0 and 1, and from Board and Jim. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Crew Tyrone from Militia Fight Academy. I'd like to take a timeout to thank one of our sponsors for this fight, Magical Signs, for awning, printing, and much more. Check them out, Magical Signs. And his opponent currently making his way down to the ring, fighting out of the red corner. This is Eric Kupo. Eric Kapo. 5'5", 125 pounds, he's a righty. And this is his debut fight with an 0-0 record. And I got here, he's from Chuck Zabai. This should be a great fight between Capo and Ishkaev. Both fighters are from New York. Tony, Capo looks focused and ready to go. This should be an interesting battle. We have Capo here in the purple trucks. And Ishkaev in the black and white. And now, ladies and gentlemen, for the introduction. This contest, scheduled for three two-minute rounds to be contested under only time rules. The weight class is 125 pounds. Introducing first. Intimidate Ishkaev. Some vicious footstops. As the fighters get ready mentally for the first round. And here we go, Tony. Capo establishing the center of the ring. Oh, oh great spinning back fist by Ishkaev. Oh, oh, excellent kick. Felix is locking up the arm. The referee breaks it up. Ishkaev just going for Capo. Capo Capo is a smaller fighter, but he's trying to push the pace, close that distance to get this working. Definitely looks like Ishkaev is trying to trying to keep back, test his distance, trying to get some quick shots in there. Capo seems to be taking advantage of that, pushing him to the corner of the ring, but broke it up. Go with the knees. Eric is using the knees. Oh. Good takedown by Eric. Ishka is getting into his clinches, but not really able to do anything from them. Ishka is throwing vicious knees to the body. Up, oh, there you go. Eric taking down again from the clinch. Eric is a strong fighter. He's a smaller fighter, but he's establishing strength. Capo also not afraid to get his hands dirty, get right in there. This guy even applying pressure to Capo once again. And Capo is trying to benefit with some knees. Now separated. Capo's not backing down. He's pushing the fight and another sweep. There you go. Ten seconds left in the round. Capo's going for that leg kick. I gotta say, this whole round for me felt like Capo was getting in there, doing what he had to do. Ishkaev was uh, testing out the distance a lot. Uh, trying to come after Capo, but not really able to execute anything. How do you see it here, Crew? 
I feel Capo, the smaller fighter, really push the pace and try to cut the distance in to eliminate the reach. But Iskayev controlled the pace and kept the distance so he can land the strikes. Definitely a messy fight. They got right in there with each other. Let's see what they do here in round two. This guy brought the fight right to him. This guy definitely wants to turn around the fight here in round two. Capo does a leg like, grab. This game goes down. Eric kept keep putting him down, but he needed a lot more than that to win the fight. He just cut the distance and throws the, the body. Go. Go, go. Ashkeev fighting out of that corner as Capo is applying steady, steady pressure. Both get wrapped up here. Capo throwing knees. Ishkaev returns. Good check by Capo. And there we go. Went for the sweep and took it down. Another back fist by Ishkaev. Followed by a cross. Throwing those leg kicks. Reach is really bothering Capo at this point. Capo got him in the clinch. Two knees to the body. But Iskaev is holding him on to the holding him in the corner. He's going with the cross. Another cross to the, the cross landed. Iskaev coming a little bit alive here. Oh, That's great it. shot to the face by Iskaev. And that'll do it here for round two. Crew, how you, how you, uh, how you seeing it here? Impressive display by Capo in his debut. But Iskaev kept going the back fist, using his reach and keeping him off. With a little experience, Capo could overcome that. But right now, the reach is just too much for him. Watch some replays here. Strong shots here by Escape. And we get ready here for round three versus Capo versus Escape. Capo, here we go. We start out strong, as always. Here we go. Escape, much more aggressive this round here. Coming out of Oh, great move. Down. Great move by Capo there. Good check by Capo. There you go, clinch him up, with the clinch, another knee, knees to the body. You see he's using his, his height, his reach, his strength. Both fighters are exchanging knees there. And we're back in at the middle. Capo advancing. Good check the return. By cop by Capo. You see with a straight and a cross. That one two but on the cross landed. Here we go. Capo left that center open. Ishkaev monopolized on that. Straight shot right to the face. Ishkaev, another cross to the face. Capo's pushing the pace. He's not backing down. Bringing that fight. Capo definitely seems like he has confidence here. Worried about that offensive. Just trying to get in there wherever he can. He just has to worry, watch out for that cross. That cross landed a little bit too much in this round. Held on it, hold on to the clinch. Here we go. Oh, good flying knee by Iskayev. Bullfire's just back and forth here. Anyone's match here. Ten seconds left in round three. Ishkaev tries to uh, take down. Capo stays on his feet, and that'll do it here. At Fury 3, Ishkaev 
Versus Capo. How do you score this, crew? I thought it was a very good fight, good exchange. Uh, Ishkaib landed a little bit too much one cross in the, in the beginning and the, the ending of the round. Capo definitely had the aggression here, constantly chasing. A couple of times left himself wide open. Let's see how the judges score it. After three hard fought rounds of Muay Thai combat, the winner of this bout as a result of judges, unanimous decision, the Blue Corner. Here, I That was a good fight, and Capo really brought it. He showed a lot of heart and determination. Never back down. Smaller guy in the fight, never back down. Congratulations to Felix Ishkaev.